Hey, this is Bruce Brown, and today I'm going to talk to you about this product, security product I have called Ring Video Doorbell. And I did another video about it. Uh, if you want to check that out, you can go to my review of the product. I actually really like it. One of the main issues that I've had with it is that it has a little bit of latency, but I think it has something to do with the fact that I have two different networks in my house and it's actually attached to the network that's furthest away from the ring doorbell. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna detach the video doorbell and then reset it to another network. So that's what this video is gonna be about. We are outside in front of the door and this tool comes with ring.com doorbell, video doorbell. Let's go ahead and detach this and then we're going to get into the guts of this thing, okay? Now this is one of the security concerns about ring ring.com is that it's very easy to detach so the fear is some somebody could actually steal it from your <laughs> from your porch <laughs> but uh, now keep in mind if they do that it'll be recorded so who would be dumb enough to to tamper with a video camera that's gonna capture their image and potentially get them arrested so let's just go ahead and detach it the two bottom screws here and then we'll be able to remove it from the plate. So once you detach the two screws, you just pop it up like that, and that's how you remove it. What you have to do is go into the app, go to the device, and then device settings, and then what we want to do is remove device remove this device yes and now we're going to re-add the device so let's go ahead and re-add the device it's asking us what kind of device we have we have video doorbell we're going to say front door we're going to continue here we go. We're going to hit the orange button. Now we're going to continue. So now it's pairing with the device with my app on my phone. It's asking me which Wi Fi, and I'm going to set it up to the closest one. And then I'm just going to go ahead and type in my password here. So it looks like it's paired with the device. So let's go ahead and continue. Now here it asks you if there's anybody else you'd like to add to the ring.com and I do have somebody I would ask add my wife so that she can get the alerts whenever the, somebody comes to the door. So after all of that's set up, everything is good, then you can go ahead and install it back on your door. So the last thing we did is we tested to make sure it worked. It looks like it's working just fine. Go. Okay, so I wanted to introduce you to another product from uh, Ring.com, Ring Video Doorbell, and it's called the Chime. And so the reason why I got it is because the actual video doorbell doesn't interact with your house doorbell. Here's our house doorbell right here. So sometimes the phone doesn't ring on time, or I just didn't hear my phone ring, or my phone's somewhere else in another room, or whatever. So I got the chime so that it rings upstairs and downstairs. Now, here it is right here. We've already paired the device. Yeah, a little bit. No. Yeah. Okay, so I've already connected it, actually. So you got an upstairs and a downstairs chime. Here is what it looks like. I'll show you the product in a minute. Let's do a sound test. Yeah.
and let's go back to this and let's see once you pair these devices then it connects to it. so follow me okay so here's the chime right here just unplug it just plug it right into the wall and as you can see once I bought the device then you just you pair it with your phone and then you hit a button on the back and then that sends out a signal and it allows you to pair the, it has instructions on it, it's actually pretty easy but um, that's all it is right there and so I'm just gonna plug this back in and we're gonna do another sound check takes a minute for it to warm back up I think there we go so that's it that's it we put one upstairs one downstairs it actually is pretty good it works I mean it tells us when somebody's going in front of the door it tells us when somebody rings the doorbell and sends us a of course a video image of the front porch and everything it's pretty cool so that's the chime with the video doorbell and I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please like and subscribe. I got plenty more stuff uh, like this content coming out that's dealing with security issues, technical issues, things like that. So see you later. So the last thing we did was test it out. All right, double tap it. Why does it work when I do it? So the last thing we did was to test it out. It looks like it's working. So what I had to do after I reset it was to reset the alerts. For some reason that um, made it uh, stop giving rings quickly. So after I reset the alerts, just turn it off and on because it was already set to on. Uh, then uh, it started working again. And that's it. Thanks a lot, Alyssa. Why did I do that? Saw someone actually get killed. You want to be, and you know, in, in and I'm sure it's not going to be easy for you to relive some of this stuff or go through it. And maybe you don't even talk about it a lot. I know a lot of guys who've really been through the really traumatic stuff. They don't really talk about it because it's too hard to like keep going over it. You know, you want to be very specific about what happened down to the most minute detail and if you have to don't even type it in here write it in if you can if you want to put everything in there but one thing I learned from being a cop is you want to be very specific about the times you want to put the who what when where and why of what happened like a crime scene you want to describe it like it's a crime scene 
and that means you got to be very very detailed and, you, and if you have to go through your old documents go through what I did was I went through my old awards I said man I can't remember what actual day that was what time frame what infantry what uh, unit I was with so I actually had to go through all of my documents and figure out who what organization I was actually with to explain all of that 